morning. Monday, 12 o'clock. The sun is starting to come out. It's been pissing down with rain all morning. I've got one to do today. Lovely VFR, which I picked up on the way down. This is a new client. Wants it minted up. Bit of paint correction. And he wants the Ultimax Signature Pro Ceramic. He uh, rode it a couple of weeks ago. Put it away and come out and it's covered in white fur. Chains gone rusty, swing arm, nuts and bolts. So we're gonna give it a good old wash down. I'm gonna polish up things like this. A little spindle there, swing arm, hook pegs. See how they're going all rusty. We're gonna cover it in ACF 50. Polish up this exhaust, get all that grit off. Then we're going to get it in the uh, in the garage, and I'm going to do a bit of paint correction on it. I saw a bit of a uh, few scratches here and there, so we're going to give it a good old buff up, and then treat it to a nice coating of Ultimax Signature Pro, so it's be fully minted and fully protected. She's really. He said it was really clean before he went out. Only got caught in the rain once all it takes anyhow so let's get cracking okay first stage is done I've done the well, three-step wash on this I uh, pre-rinse it then I snow foam it rinse it again degrease it and then I wash all the body work and then give it a good rinsing I then blow dry it getting all the moisture out of all the switch gear all your suspension linkages all your wiring everything's been blow dried now it's time to get it into the garage and uh, work some miracles. I don't know whether you can see on this video, but this paintwork, look at that. It's like it's been cleaned with sandpaper previously. It's the only problem with black. It shows up every little mark. Gonna have to uh, see if we can get some gloss back into that. Tank, pull the body work. Oh heavily scratched tanks not too bad it's just the fairing we're gonna get it in blow dry it a bit more we're gonna paint the center side stand I'm gonna do a drying the last bit of moisture out of all the switch gear I've uh, blow dried this chain get any moisture out residue out a little tip which I always do I always heat my chain lube up oh get it nice and warm give it a good old shake and then I put uh, a bit of paper towel behind the chain inside there there so when you when you oil it up, do the inside and then do the outside of the links. Give it a good coating. And then with the paper towel stops any of the spray going everywhere else. As this chain lube's nice and hot, it uh, gets in all the nooks and crannies. Nice little tip for you. There you go, one well lubed chain with not a speck anywhere else. Sweet! Okay, next stage is done. She's all been ACF 50 I've painted the center and side stand, touched up a few nuts and bolts. Now we're gonna get down to some polishing. I don't know whether you can see that. It literally looks like it has been cleaned with sandpaper. I don't have one of these special paint detecting lights, but uh, you can definitely see on that. Let's see if we can uh, get some of them scratches out. All right, just done my first little run with my uh, Rupees Bigfoot. Look at that. That's just one pass. Good old Rupees. Get rid of all these marks. 
All right, I have just finished the polishing paintwork side of things. I had to show you before I crack on with this exhaust. This paintwork, oh my God. That's three separate runs, one with a coarse polish, then with a fine polish, and I've just done it one more time with an ultra fine. Oh, look at the results speak for themselves. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you saw it earlier. Okay, first up is these wheels. I have just prepped them. I run an alcohol mixture on a rag, made sure there's no contaminants on these rims whatsoever. I'm gonna put the Ultimax Slicks ceramic on the wheels. That's one year's worth of ceramic protection. And then we will crack on with the uh, bodywork. Okay, the wheels have now been ceramic. Looking sweet, look at that. Now we're gonna do the paintwork. I've just run my alcohol mixture over it just to make sure there's no oils, waxes, contaminants. I've got my heaters on. And I've got my Ultimax Signature Pro in hand. This is five years worth of ceramic paint protection. I'm gonna lay that down, let it sit for a couple of minutes, and then we're gonna buff it off and she will be finished. Well, there you go. This VFR has been fully trotted and looking sweet. I'm gonna call this package the full works. This is a three and a half to four and a half hour package. Covers pretty much everything. I've given it a three stage wash, blow dry, brought it in, painted the side stand, center stand, ACF 50 everything. Brought it in the garage here. As you've seen, I've done a three-stage paint correction. Got all the blemishes out, all the scratches, all the hazing. I have then laid down the special source, Ultimax Signature Pro. If you can see this in person, this paintwork, oh my God, it is absolutely gleaming. Everything has been polished. All your exhaust, all your footrest hangers, even the end of your footrest, the little scraper things have all been mirror polished. All your levers have been mirror polished. All the plastics have been dressed. You saw I, I, I put a ceramic on the uh, wheels. All the chain had been degreased, re-lubed, mirror polished up the sprocket hub there. All the swing arms have been polished. There's not anything that hasn't been polished on this bike. Absolutely gleaming. Look at that. Is, the rag just glides over it. Imagine what the water's gonna do. Every detailer's dream. A bit of water beading. Anyhow, she's done. Gonna load her up, get her delivered. This is the full package trot. Pick up delivery, three and a half to four hours. Get yours booked in now. Open seven days a week. Satisfaction always guaranteed. 07966 249963.